all right what's up guys welcome back to another amazing video thank you so much for watching on this video i'm gonna be talking about zen so far it is looking really good for the token price we are sitting at six zeros in a four two all other networks seem to be doing pretty good some more than others which for example pulse chain has been doing really good for zen as well as phantom and i think even evmos looks pretty good as well guys <laughs> It is insane how much of a sleeper Zen still is. In my prediction, I think Jack is going to launch X1 right at the Bitcoin happening. That's what I really do think so. He's that type of guy in which he would do something on that day. And it can be, you know, so, uh, easy day to remember. It can be put down in the book and the crypto legacy type of style. So I can see that happening, but we will only see. That's my prediction. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Um, I'm very curious about what you think he's going to do. Maybe you guys know him better than I do. I don't know. But on the daily, this looks, you know, pretty good. What I really want to show is that four hourly. It's like slowly creeping up on us. I did have a PC update, so that's why none of my lines or supporter resistance, not even my 1334 is on here. Every single time I my PC has a, a big update, Microsoft or whatever, uh, it just messes up my whole entire U uh, OBS settings. It messes up my whole entire like tabs. It doesn't save anything. So you know what? I'll do it on my spare time. I'm not going to do it right now on the video. What I am going to show you guys is this that or well for me it's crazy maybe for some of you guys it's not crazy but this wallet here i didn't even know i had to be honest with you i randomly i didn't even have this one saved <laughs> in my um i have a spreadsheet and i have also the wallets saved on zenmon to be honest with you guys i was randomly claiming my zen on pulse chain and I was just looking at my wallets, right? Just to be curious. And I ran into this wallet. I just claimed two of them. These, these Zen NFTs, um, they're claimable since the 14th, I think. Yeah, the 14th, which is today's day is the 15th. Yeah, 15th. So yesterday, these were due. And luckily, I'm so glad I found these on time. I have 50 of these pretty much to claim like <laughs> i claimed these two right before i record and i was like wait let me hold on and do it so i have all this <laughs> so that's just crazy i have 50 of these that i have to go on here and claim at the current price of pulse chain this is about 400 plus dollars literally and i can do whatever i want to with it reinvest it hold on to it burn it you know into db's in or you know, do 50-50. I really don't know what I'm going to do with it. I'm probably going to have to brainstorm a little bit and figure out what's going to be the strategy. I started claiming the first two, but I noticed the gas fee is a little high, quote unquote high, but it's not really, but it's higher than normal. It's usually hovering around two to 3,000 um, PLS in order for me to be able to claim this. And I don't know why this is saying 11,000 no idea so like I'll, i'm good with around 2000 3000 is what it normally is but right now it's hovering around 5000 so i may hold off just a little longer maybe like in the next 30 minutes to an hour so that way i can have it ready i'm gonna have to refresh this i don't know why that is showing up oh it's because oh i claimed three of them i didn't even know that okay so that's why that gas fee and everything was going pretty crazy. I don't like whenever my PC doesn't update, yo. It feels like it gets slower and slower every single time. So now I can actually show you guys what the deal is. So now this should be around 4,000. Hopefully if it's lower, it'd be amazing. I hate MetaMask with a passion. Oh my God. It is so slow and it's annoying. 3,600. Okay. Accept it. That's fine. So I got to do this about 40 plus times, which is perfectly fine with me. Um, I remember this wallet. This was like one of the early, early ones. I think I got each of these wallet for about three to five dollars. I don't I don't think I got these for like a dollar ish or less. 
because they still have the EAA, which was way in the early days. And I'm pretty sure it was like three or five dollars that I paid per each one. But even if it was five dollars, that is still two hundred and fifty dollars of gas to be able to have all of these. And it, this is over four hundred dollars. So one and a half X ish, give or take, you know, that's still profit in my book. That's still amazing to see, man, that I love PLS. I love Pulse Chain. I love Zen on Pulse Chain. And I literally, if you've been following me on Twitter, by the way, it is Crypto Audit King. The link's going to be down below in the description. If you've been following me and been here for a while, I was literally bashing left and right Pulse Chain, man. It is a sleeper. It is going to do good. Don't sleep on it. And that's whenever I started going crazy, man. Like over 1,500 Zen NFTs is what I have. Like it's crazy. Multiple wallets, a bunch of just Zen NFTs everywhere. Each wallet has like 200. So I'm going to have to go through all of my wallets again and make sure I didn't miss out on any of these because it's very critical. Let, and I'm going to have to like rescan everything and save it again on Zenmon just in case one or two had a hiccup. And oh, again, so probably this one already got claimed. And I don't like how it does that. This is what it's probably MetaMask just being a little girly girl, not wanting to work right. And just these little sec sections, I'm, I claimed 13.2, what is it, billion? Not bad. Plus, so six times two, 12. That's, a, that's already a decent amount of money, man. That's all right. I'm really happy with that. So now I'm going to have to do this all throughout the whole entire night <laughs> and check all of my wallets. And don't forget, guys. Don't forget to claim your Zen Classic, okay? If you had any mints before the snapshot or right at the snapshot or whatever, then you can also claim Zen Classic. It's a very critical coin. That's the only one that's Zen is not mintable anymore, not stakeable, nothing. Like, it, the supply is ridiculously low compared to all of these. And it has some huge huge potential don't let that be a, a, a goner don't let that just go away from you okay check all of your wallets make sure you know you know you don't have one or that you do because you could potentially be missing out on a lot of money whenever it comes to that zen classic man if you don't remember it's that airdrop that uh, pulse chain did whenever you know richard hart was doing that whole entire Pulse chain stuff. Every token on under Ethereum got a one to one copy of it. So if you had a Zen NFT under Ethereum or coins or even mint had any minting at all before it, then you should be able to have some sort of Zen classic or you know the Zen OG as some people call it. I've I've seen some people go crazy over it, and I'm not sleeping on it. I hope you aren't either. But guys that's going to be it for this video let me know if you are enjoying the content for zen let me know if you are still claiming if you believe in zen all of the above make sure you click the like button subscribe by seeing you guys in the next video take it easy i'm out peace